we're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Fellas, I'm here for one thing. Look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Not yeah, right? yeah, I know, I know. And I wanna help you, okay? <laughs> I will. But first, indulge me. It'll take two seconds. As a show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Sam Digby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. It's just a quick slug. I'm not gonna hurt anybody. And then we'll, you know, help you out with your thing. I'll toast to this. <laughs> to the dead. All right, now help me. Gren, the doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking gonna warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my back. I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it. It's done. <laughs> <laughs> Separate him. What more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? I don't want anything from you, Woody. I want there to be a big black hole where your fat, dumb fucking ass used to be. <laughs> I absolutely cannot babysit you dumbasses right now. And whatever this is, I mean that. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard the news. This walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. And Holly had to find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. Trick after trick of this fat ass and little. I didn't plan for that, all right? Your thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out, and you knew for a damn good fucking reason. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always such a low life. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay, because I'll tell you what he thinks. He thinks you have to pay chicks to touch your fat, hairy ass. That's what he thinks. Just get out of here, Woody. I'm sorry, but I'm starting to like Gren more. I don't know where Lily's shit is. Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's nah, the Nah, that's mean. Maybe uh, ogres, too. I can't find her stuff. I might have. Actually, Big B, if you'll excuse me, it seems that I'm going to pass out. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. I'm trying to remember this. <laughs> He won't remember. <laughs> what she drink too? We technically could. She's a heavy sleeper. Is that you? 
Yeah. Sure. Forty. Bar's closed. And Lily ain't around anyway, so you can run off back to the woods, I guess. Wait, she knew? Was a photo like on the wrong side. Did you care about her at all? She was a nice girl. Ran around too much. I'm not gonna. But a nice girl. Of course I cared. I still care. I hope so. I hope you do. What well, these options become available now? I don't know why you fucking came here. There's nothing left for you to ruin. And I'm not in an entertaining mood. I'm sorry, Holly. I'm sorry for what happened. I'll make it up to you. Ah, sure you will, kid. When the rivers turn coarse and the sky bleeds fucking gypsies. <laughs> Don't need the brooch, really, so we can save that for last. Lily's funeral. It was just so fucked tonight. But I still wish she could have been there. This Tweedles I ruined it. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it, if he even gives a shit. Yeah, I'm sure he does. I don't know. I don't know why he should. It's just a job to him. I just wish he'd get out of my fucking life. He cares about this, about Lily, <laughs> about Faith. I should have talked as like the woodsman, so. like. <laughs> well, you know him better than anybody, so uh, I guess I'll take your word for it. <laughs> You're getting your glamour on this day. One of these has to be the witch. I don't know who. Which one? Hello, this is Snow White calling. Looking for Big. He's still passed out. Anyone there? Big B, if you're there, hang up, okay? Snow? Hey, I just wanted to see how it was going. Did you find anything? Just an address book with her contacts and initials. Not sure which one is the witch, though. Strange. People keep. Before, a few days ago, I thought I knew everyone in Big Bay. Any chance you can cross-reference these with the records in the business office? Maybe track her down that way. Yeah, but who knows how long that'll take. You should try going up to Clinton's room. I sent Buffkin up there to check on things. Bluebeard, you know. Or you could try at the Tweedle's office. Just make it quick. We don't have a lot of time. The meeting is at two. I'll go to the head over to office Clinton. last if we can. Find there. Sounds good. <laughs> Keep me posted. In the meantime, I'll see what I can do on this one. Okay. Good luck, Big Beak. You'll find him, Snow. I hope you're right. Can we go back for like the glamour? <laughs> no. <laughs> hey, Debbie, what do you want? Bluebeard burned everything. <laughs> I tried to stop him, but I got here too late. He wouldn't listen to me. Threatened to strangle me if I got too close. There was nothing I could do. Honest. It's not your fault, Buffkin. I should have come here first. Didn't think you <coughs> would mess things up this badly.
burned clock. Isn't it burnt? Why would it be burned? Isn't it burnt? And I know it. Since I wanted to be burnt. Now? Waste of fucking time. What now? Did you find any information about the witch at the trip trap? Just this. I don't know which one she is, but to start, maybe I can find more at the tweeter's office. It's worth a try. I'd better go fill Miss White in on the circumstances. She's going to be very disappointed. Good luck. Froggy hat. Excuse me. Oh, hi. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you remember me. I've, uh, seen you around, but you may have forgotten. I know who you are, Black Hatchet. You've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <laughs> I think I've lost count. But you know, Crane, uh, let me go recently. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I mean, it's no big deal. So... What brings you here? I mean, can I help you with anything? Are you here to see one of the brothers? D or Dunk? They, they aren't, they're in here right now. I'm not sure when they'll be back. Did you make an appointment? Because I can let you in if you want to wait. You seen Crane around? Not around here. I saw him leave the woodlands earlier, but I'm not supposed to bother him. I don't really think he likes me. It's been uh, a quiet night so far. I think the twins are out, probably working on a case. Oh, Sometimes they're definitely out the working on a case. He gave me the job after Crane told me to get lost. <coughs> he said I was just in the way. But I like it here. Gotta stay busy, you know? Otherwise... Well, it's nice working here anyway. Where's their office? Oh, right this way. I, I was going there next anyway. I can let you in if you want. You can wait for them there. Sure. Thanks. No problem. I'm gonna have to take a look around. <laughs> uh, well, I, I guess that would be okay. I wasn't really asking for permission. Right, you're the sheriff. I just don't want to get in trouble or anything. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> I mean, they never told me not to let you in. Don't worry, I won't get you in trouble, all right? So you just... Right. Yeah, recaps. Chess. Dear Brother Dumb, I hate dogs and you know it. Sincerely, Brother D. Nice. They do have their quirks. So what does this one say? No dogs. Dear Brother D, I think we should get ourselves a dog. Sincerely, Brother Dumb. Couple of freaks. <laughs> This is pointless. I, I know these guys can come off abrasive at times, but they aren't so bad once you get to know them. Oh, really? And they really care about helping people. They're oh. kind of loud at times, but you get used to it. I guess they have to be in their line of work. <laughs> Dee always tells me you have to be assertive. How do you mean they help people? They're detectives. Anyone can come in here with a problem and they'll do their best to fix it. The way Dee explains it, it's like if someone lost their cat, well, they could hire them to, you know, track it down. Or like sometimes they get packages for people. They can be like couriers, you know? Or who? All kinds. Come to think of it, I don't really know where they keep them. <laughs> that not raise red flags. Saying, you just don't know them like I do. Sure, black catcher. This? No, no. You can't take a cigar. Don't touch. Don't touch him. Hell on him. Don't touch him. I'm 
I'm sure you have your reasons, but it's just they, they've done so much for me. I'm missing something, aren't I? Oh. Let's see if they got a file on the crane. They do. This is worse than I thought. Shit. <laughs> Detective Brannigan? Keep an eye on her. Keep an eye on that one. That's a small file. <laughs> ah, Cinderella. <laughs> she looks different. <laughs> Crane hired them to look for a photo? So that's why they were at her apartment. And the woodsman's place. <laughs> Interesting. See, I knew you wouldn't find anything. Anything of interest, anyways. Th they're detectives. Like I said, just just trying to make an honest living. See? I haven't found anything yet. I'm just saying. Look, just trust me on this. Tweedledee and Dumb are not nice. They're not helping anyone. Can I well, check the last folder? Me. Okay, great. They helped you. I want to check One the last folder. <laughs> no, please. Just let me concentrate here. Thank you. Ichabod Crane. Who's the crooked man money? Who's the crooked yeah. man? How's he planning to pay this all back? Times 12, times 75. Request for property acquisition, further details filed under donkey skin. Why did he want it back so badly? Find anything? Not what I need. W what, if, what if you're wrong about them? I'm not. They're misunderstood, sure, but that doesn't mean everything people say about them is true. It took a gun to me. I mean, Why would they know, do that? Uh, think about it. You guys aren't that different. You help people, and they help people. Not that it's any of my business, but I just wanted to say, you know, give them a chance. People can surprise you. Let's get one thing straight. They are nothing like me. Bigby? Shit. There's something here. I know there is. There has to be. Why would there be anything Because to... they're lying to you, okay, flycatcher? That's why. They aren't detectives. I click that one. Bigby, what happened to your... You want to know what this is? This is them showing up to Lily's funeral with fucking shotguns! I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I... I, I didn't know. Holly and Grand both I know, I clicked the option. Snow White nearly got her head blown off. Do you get it now? Laid it on too thick. I didn't mean to. There's a door behind this file cabinet. Now, I don't know what they keep back here, but it might be what you're looking for. Why would you hide this from us? Well, that key you found should work. So good. <laughs> that's a good. That's good. Do you really need a frog? Like that's so good. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> oh my gosh. Blend coffee. Oh, that's the rich stuff. JD. Jane Doe? John Doe? The book. What are you looking for exactly? Maybe I can help. Anything about Crane or oh, the witch he was using. Some gobshite. This doesn't really tell us much. Yeah, I haven't looked into it to see what it could mean. <laughs> the 
butcher. The butcher. The butcher. What is this stuff? <laughs> I saw something about a crooked man. Is that like Folger's cut? I'm late. I'll get it to you soon. Money. Hair of the lucky pawn. You know what that is? Nah, we'll just leave the money. It makes it more obvious that we're gonna take the money. <laughs> is that what you needed? I don't think so. It's interesting. There's more going on here. Still need to find that witch, though. What's this? Hey, Big B. Do you think, after all this, do you think I could come back to the woodlands? Since you get you a job. I mean, I can still work here, but I don't think I want to now. I don't want to work with bad people, you know? You and Snow, you're nice. Well, Crane is gone now. I, I can't see why you couldn't come back to the woodlands. Really? That would be, thank you. Come by the business office. I can't make any promises. All right, of course. A lock of Snow White's hair. Snow's hair. Snow White? Why? We found her hair like this inside Lily's glamour. Auntie Green. This must be the witch Crane was using. I guess Dee and Dumb were getting the hair for Crane and Sandy. How would they get the hair, though? It's not a pleasant thought. A.G. A.G. This is it. I have to tell Snow. This is the place. There, there's a phone right over there. Thanks, Flora. Business office? I know who she is. <laughs> Look happy and huff and puff. Look happy. <laughs> Big B! I just got here. Yeah. Me too. It's number 23. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, I know. This is it. 14 All minutes right. late. How do you want to do this? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> Hear anything? If anyone's in there, they're being awfully quiet. There's no one in there. <laughs> I'll be nice. Room service. Hello. It's a kit. Hi. You woke me up. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry about that much, kid. I don't think I've ever seen you before. Well, pardon the intrusion. I wasn't aware this was the Munchkin's house. No, Dorothy, it isn't. <laughs> Sharp kid. <laughs> who are you? Rachel, who are you? Just so we're not strangers. I'll just do baby. This is Snow. Nice to meet you. How do you do? Is there a, is there anything you need? I'm not allowed to let people in. Is your mother at home? I don't need a babysitter. I can cook dinner all by myself. You can? Is there something you want? I don't think I can really help you. Maybe come back in the morning. Rachel, do you mind if I take just a quick peek around? We'll be very quick, and he won't touch anything. Uh oh. It's a Wendigo skull. I've been here all night. Nobody's been here. <coughs> okay, Bigby. I'm gonna trust you not to break anything. Don't get me in trouble. Why you gonna smash uh, all of your shit. Crane, you can still be here. <laughs> oh, what dear skull? I thought that was Wendigo. <laughs> I've been oh, thinking no, too, like, 
until dawn for some reason. It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. Dowdy, that's how we like it. I need to adjust the settings here a bit to see what it's like. No one's been over all night. But... He's just going to check. It'll only take a moment. Let me guess. Big band or classical? Honky tonk. <laughs> Honky tonk. <laughs> Who's that? Where do you buy? Your mom. Uh huh. Where's she at? I saw a spider over there yesterday. Oh? It was a green mm -hmm. one. Don't tell me he's hiding in here. The butcher. Butcher. What's that? A package having to do with someone called the butcher. I saw one just like it at the Tweedle's office. <sighs> Not here. There's no one here but me. How much longer do you think it'll be? Forever. Like Crane was here either. Nothing? See? <laughs> You're getting smug with me. Do you like broccoli? Not really. I love it. <laughs> What's this? What is this? Mommy uses that to carve her trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? <laughs> um, like glamours? Shouldn't say that. Nothing. Keep getting whiffs of that aftershave of his. I do too. <laughs> Can I go to bed now, please? Maybe he just left. Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I've tried. You've tried? Oh, no, 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 please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigley's not going to break no, it. you don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. But I'm already grounded. Just put it back exactly where it was, please. I'm not going to break it. I just want to open it. No, put it down. Be okay, Rachel. Please, I'm begging you. I don't want to. I don't want to get in trouble. You won't. <laughs> I take great grief. It hurts when you do it that fast. <laughs> what? Not sprightly enough? You think we have time to waste on this shit? You think this is some kind of game? No, I don't. But congratulations on winning it, if that matters to you. All right, start explaining. And from the beginning. I was born in the woods to a jackal and did not that. A jackal and a deer. But witchcraft crap is going to prevent me from prying what I need from your gullet. Now tell me where Crane is. I ain't a fortune teller, wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You have to know something. Unless you want a recipe for owl stew, there's nothing owl I know. Owl stew? You're an accomplice to murder. Do you realize that? You might want to check your facts on that. It doesn't matter. I can't help you. Technically you. are. I have no interest in being turned into a skink and crushed under boot heels. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Whatever it is, Greenleaf, whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something, you have to forget it. 
This is more important. Is this? We can protect you, okay? Whatever it is you're afraid of, we can make sure that it won't come to pass. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap if she's afraid for her life. We can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! How dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two fables are dead because of this attack. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. Very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. I'm sorry, Shay. But please, don't do this. Isn't there another way? She's a witch. Can't she just work for us? That way she'd be official. You want to reward her for criminal behavior? We can't trust this woman on the 13th. Day. It doesn't matter, because I'd never do it. I'm not a house cat, and I don't play well with others. Oh, trust me, no one would confuse you for a cuddly animal. 